Ah, no, eso es en el, en, el, en el Ministerio de Hacienda. Sí. Con el usuario del cliente, sí. Ingresa y allá se los pago. Los Hello, good evening. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Heidi. How are you? Uh, Still at work? Still at work. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. A long day. Yeah, but su successful day. Oh, that's great. That's great. And what time do you think you are going to finish? Maybe in an hour, maybe, an hour and a half. 
an hour and a half. My gosh, mm -hmm. a long, long day. I hope it will be four, but we'll try. Complex. Yeah. The closing is a hard day. Yeah, but it, but this is the last hard day of the month. So tomorrow I'll be absolutely connected, completely focused on the class. And a little <laughs> bit more relaxed. Yeah, of course. And it's going to be yeah. Friday. Thinking about the weekend. Okay. Well, and, and vacation is closed at least a couple of days for you, right? And you already know the date of the day of the Holy Weekend we're resting or not? I haven't asked to be honest, but I suppose, yeah, because we are finishing the third week. I guess it's the second week, right? The second week of the month. Yeah. Yeah, uh, supposedly the week of the, from the 11th. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what I'm wondering is, is like how many days we are going to have from support. Mm. I guess the whole week. I guess the whole week too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're going to be happy. You're not going to be on class at least for a week. You're going to relax. I deserve it. <laughs> That's great. No, you know what's cool is this, that you're going to have vacation, then one week of class, then a little pause for the next level, for the next module. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's hope that module starts fast. Yeah, let's hope so. Because, uh, I don't know, I guess next week they're going to start sending you the paperwork. Ah, uh, the bank has confirmed we have already sent them. Oh, really? So it's already yeah. in? That's it's already in, and, and they said that papers are okay. Oh, that's great. That's great. Mm -hmm. That means that we are running are with good. the paperwork. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it means that we are going to be, it's going to be less time than the one that we are going to be on post. Mm -hmm. That's excellent. Yeah, because otherwise you have to be like waiting for a longer time and, you know, that's that's actually bad for the for for your fluency because when you stop practicing for a couple of weeks then there are some classmates that they it's hard for them to start over again mm -hmm. yeah but but we all have to do the paperwork right yep mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay so uh, and you have to wait for everybody to finish their at your work. I got the key. <laughs> so you gotta stay until the last one finishes. <laughs> it's that uh, my assistant branch manager is uh, in charge of opening and I have to close. So I really have to wait. Oh my gosh. The one that opens doesn't have to close. So. But it's okay. That's the way it works. Yeah, it's part of the job. Mm -hmm. It's part of the game. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I mean, one of my work, one of my jobs, uh, I need to be there at the first one in the morning. I need to be there this week. Is the one that I have assigned to, to be there at 6.30, 6, between 6.20, 6.30 a.m. But next week, I'm going to be like at seven, cool. Mm -hmm. Because believe me, that half an hour, man, I miss it. My no, problem is that for me, it's, for me, it's, uh, uh, I mean, I go to bed pretty late, no problem. But to wake up, man, I'm the type of guys that you need to throw me out of the bed. <laughs> I can't imagine. Yeah, it's it's a little bit hard for me. Yeah. What about you? Well, in your case, you can you don't you cannot do that because I mean you got your family, you got your kids, you need to be waking up everybody. Exactly. See you later. 
exactly. So it's not that easy with, oh, well, tell me, what about your kids? Are they easy to raise in the morning or are they hard? They're the first ones. They're the That's first ones? That's why one? get up late because the little one wakes up at six every single day. He goes to oh bed at gosh. eight and wakes up at six, so much better than the alarm. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Yeah, but there's never rest because they start like breakfast, as soon as they wake up, they start calling for mama. Yeah. Sorry, I have to leave you, teacher. I have to. No problem. You. No problem. Go ahead. See you go later. ahead. See Thank ya. you, teacher. See you. Jose Wilfredo, hello. So far, so good. It was an easy day today. Just I received uh, one email with my new credential because I have to use a new tools for my position and um, was really good because today I, I have a, a an extra meeting with a lot of it looks like a hundred. Oh my gosh, how did it go? <laughs> You're getting the, 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 oh, the, the rhythm of their speech? Yeah, yeah. I told you like, I mean, in a couple of days, in one week, I mean, that's going to be normal for you the way they speak. Yeah, that's right. I I, I, I watched one uh, video too. Uh, to, to to I don't know to teach no to learn uh, their asking, and I found that they use a lot of ing and the letter R is really a stress uh, for yeah. them. Yeah. Yes, it is. But today was easier than the other days. They also hit a lot the the T. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, but it's as I told you. I mean, after a couple of days, you really get the hang of it. I mean, it's right at the beginning that you feel like the impact of the of the accent because it's completely different. But that's normal. I mean, that happens to everybody. Even, uh, I mean, even English speaker person. I mean, when they yeah. get to know somebody who speaks English, but from another, a different country, for them, it's kind of different. It's like uh, Aussies, you know, Aussies speak mm -hmm. different. The people from Australia speak quite different. Yeah, that's right. But thanks God, everything good. Yeah, well, it's just a matter of time, get, acquainted with it and you'll have fun yeah, yeah. so yeah, what is it that what is it the account about what are you going to do in this new position oh i review well like i work in a call center so uh we review all data uh, from the agent like okay. average handle time the, the duration of the call. Okay. And the time of the call is on hold, the time of the call that is waiting for the answer. And ACW, when maybe the agent uh, end the call, but they use one auxiliary to, to, to avoid that the other uh, call uh, getting to the to the extension. So we make one report and we have to present to the client, to the direct client. Okay, so it's like, it's like quality control? No, it's like reporting, but it's like reporting because we have to create some reports and then we have to discuss with the client. Oh, okay. Uh, directly with the, with, directly with the, the owner of the, of the company. But yeah, yeah. the company that uh, subcontracted us. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. I know, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. It's, you're talking about the company who's hiring you. Yeah, yeah, that's right. But that's interesting. Yeah, yeah, we use a lot of Excel uh, reports, so that's funny. 
Okay, perfect. Excellent. Yeah, you know, yeah. in my case, the only thing that I don't like is the statistics. I hate that. <laughs> <laughs> and why? I don't know. I mean, it's it doesn't make sense. It's just that the subject is boring for me. <laughs> well, but well, maybe when you create your own company, you have to learn a lot of statistics. To be honest with you, I'm taking it at the university right now. Uh -huh. Oh, really? I, I remember that you told me that you was a, a study financial, I guess. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and, uh, the subject that I'm taking, uh, that one is the one that it's uh, really it's terrible giving me a little you. bit problem, yeah. Pain in the neck. A little bit, a little bit. <laughs> yeah, but that's going to be good for you. Uh, yeah, I know, I know. I know. But I need, I need to put more, to make a bigger effort into it. That's all. Yeah, it's just that everything I, I, in the life is effort. Yeah, it's just that I've been kind of lazy. With it. The thing is this, that my, my actually my stronger points is uh, reading comprehension, reading and analysis. That's mm -hmm. something that I like. I like to do, and that's mm -hmm. easy for me. But statistics is completely different. I mean, you need to read, you yeah. need to analyze, but you need to apply, and that's when it becomes boring for me. Yeah, it's something boring because when you end your report, you can chill in a, a, a long day. Yeah, but we will see, we will see. Well, Jose Wilfred, nice talking to you as usual. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Thank you for us. Let's see. Hey, Nicolas, how are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Fine, thank you. you. Fine, 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 teacher. Very good. Uh, today, uh, all day, all day, I am working in the office, prepare uh, to prepare uh, reports and planning the the other week. Uh, yes, it's, it's necessary planning because. Uh, uh, a group of person of the United States visit uh, from the United States from the United States uh, uh, will visit will visit yes yeah. uh, the different projects different projects uh, of the uh, in, in of of my work and I am um, uh, prepared the visit with different different directives and organization uh, of the of our Japan. Oh, interesting. Uh, have you been busy? Sorry, teacher. You've been busy. Uh, uh, been, been. Uh, I estado. You have been busy. I estado ocupado. Ah, uh, yes, teacher. Yes. Uh, uh, I, I am, I, I am a review, a review the, the videos recommend for you. Oh, that's cool. It is very interesting. It's very interesting. It's necessary to repeat, uh, to repeat uh, the videos because I know no understand different words uh, and is necessary to repeat for a uh, prepare my my oído her her yeah no. My, no my hearing my hearing is is necessary to prepare my hearing uh, uh, for for the the boys the boys boys the boss? Yeah, yeah, of course. For the, for the boys, uh, is is different. Is different the the accent. Yeah. Okay. 
is 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 very important. Is interesting. Well, interesting. No, actually, it's interesting. Thank you very much, Nicolas, and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Jacqueline, hello, Jacqueline. How are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. And How are you? How's everything? <laughs> uh, thank you, teacher. Well, it, it was another uh, normal day. Fortunately, we didn't have a lot of work like um, yesterday, but I think that <laughs> tomorrow will be a better day. Okay, yeah, of course. Of um, course. That's the, the weekend is, uh, is at the corner and that make, makes me happy, make me happy. Yeah, I mean, we are almost on weekend and you're going to rest. And relax yes. a little bit, right? Yes. That's nice. Yes. That's nice. Another important thing, teacher, is that yeah, today we get my salary. <laughs> Your what? I get my salary. I have oh, one. <laughs> payday. That's yes, cool. Payday, yeah. That's <laughs> cool. That's cool. Yeah. yeah, that's a good reason to be happy for. <laughs> yes, teacher. Thanks to us. Yeah, the only problem is that we that we teachers need to make the make it long because it's monthly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's monthly. Yeah, so I mean, well, you get used to it after some years. You get used to it. Yeah, teacher. But, thank you. But still, it's a long time. Excuse me. But it still, it's a long time. One month waiting for it is long. <laughs> yes, teacher. But fortunately, the next month, uh, well, I think that will be shorter because we have vacations. Yeah, but that's not good for me. Vacation means I spend more money. <laughs> I feel the same, but I will have time to rest and forget. Time to forget the, the routine. Yeah, that's and true. That's true. You are totally right. Well, checking in. Thank you. Welcome. Thanks, teacher. Okay, guys. Before I move on, let me get the attendance, please. Ada Susana Caceres Mendoza. Present, teacher. Good evening. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Present. Ana Claudia Gonzalez Velasquez. Present, teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. Heidi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Present teacher. Henry Neftalí Méndez Torres. Uh, Ileana Giselle Cañas Escobar. Present. Jacqueline Xiomara Morales de Castro. Present. Jose Marcos Rodríguez Ayala. Jose Osmín Rivas Navas. Present. Jose Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present, teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Rebeca Jasmine Monterrosa Figueroa. Roxana Iveta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Stephanie Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Gilman Frank Figueroa Peñate. Ramón Enrique Mata Escobar. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Ok, let's see. Perfect. Okay. 
Let me do a second, guys. Do I need to communicate something to one of your classmates? Just a second, just a second. Okay, just, I just need 30 seconds, guys, please. See who else is around. Uh, Roxana, hello, Roxana, how are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening. I'm just fine. Tired, but everything is okay. Okay. So tell me, why are you tired? You don't do nothing during the day. Yeah, I was working a lot. And after, oh, really? after working, yeah, and after working, I went to the gym around two hours, I guess. And then mm -hmm. I was looking something for it and taking a shower, you know. Okay. And tell me, what was there for dinner? Nothing. <laughs> what? We don't have dinner. Maybe I will prefer uh, milk with cereal. For real? That's for dinner? Yes. Well, you know, really, I feel really tired, teacher. So today I just eat, will eat uh, cereal, I guess. And then after class, I go to sleep. Nice. Well, you know, in my case, I remember one of these days I I just had oatmeal for dinner. Just oatmeal and and a cookie. Okay. That was horrible. It's a yeah, diet. But, you know, no, my stomach was killing me, the gastritis. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So I, I couldn't eat nothing for a couple of days. Like, let's see, Monday was bad, Tuesday was horrible, and yesterday still. Today, my stomach is starting to get better. Mm -hmm. But... Uh, Whenever I get like this, I need to follow a pretty strict diet in order to, to avoid uh, irritating my stomach, but it's horrible. Yeah. yeah, I understand. Yeah, it's complex. Well, in my case, when it's too late to cooking, I prefer it something like milk or fruits or cereal because uh, you know in my house everybody eat to okay, early around 5 6 p.m so Five yeah or and, 6 p.m yes well when i come back to the gym uh, i'm here around 7 30 and just arriving after sorry before the class and it's too late to prepare something in the in the kitchen so yeah. i prefer don't do anything there and it was well, whatever <laughs> do what i do i have dinner at 10 30. late 
Yeah, I usually have dinner after class. Like last night, I was having dinner like quarter to 11. No, 10 30. Well, in my case, I try to eat before the English class because if I eat after that, I feel um, head, a stomach, a stomach edge? No, a stomach edge. Stomach edge. Stomach edge. Stomach. Yeah, because it's 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 como it's como pesado. No sé cómo sería. Heavy. It's it's heavy. Yeah. So I try to eat before the class or when I am in the class. <laughs> or during the class. But you don't. You don't see me. Yeah, you don't usually open your camera no more. How can I see? Mm -hmm. My face. I don't even started. remember how you are now. <laughs> Last time I saw you was like, what? Uh, months ago. We, <laughs> no. No. Yep. Paul well, Roxana, nice talking to you. Welcome. Thank you. Amber, hello, Amber. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm, I'm fine. What about you? I'm just fine, just fine. Tell me, how was the day? Is the closing the end of the week? The, well, not the month. Mm, the same story, the last day. The, my day was very slowly, but... I don't have a good day in my sales. Oh, really? No. Well, tomorrow is a new day. Yes, I hope tomorrow and the next month will be better than this. And this one. Yeah, yeah, you know, some are slow, some are good, some are perfect. I mean, it's the way it goes. Yes, well, but the another things are good. Everything <laughs> else, okay, that's great. That's great. I mean, that's yes. something. Something important is to have everything like calibrated, you know. So I mean, if if something like in the job is slow, but the rest of the things are okay, you feel like well, you may do with with the other stuff, right? Exactly. But That's cool. I I try to don't affect me, but it's yeah, it's not easy. It's not easy. I mean yeah, because I mean you have certain expectatives and when they don't come out, I mean you get like man like down. That's normal. That's normal, but you know, what you say is always good. And I uh, I really admire that, that you are always like, well, let's hope tomorrow's gonna be better. Yes. And that's that's important. I mean, when the ends, tomorrow is a new day, new opportunity. New month. <laughs> yeah, many new month. So whatever happened at this month on the job, it's over. Next month is the one that comes, right? Yes, teacher. Amber, always nice talking to you. Welcome. Thank you. No, thanks to you. Let's see. Anna Claudia, hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. What's up? Here I was just, uh, I was uh, getting a uh, some minutes late today to the class because I was still sending some email, but now I'm complete. I finish all my tasks for the month. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's nice, that's nice. Mm -hmm. So the month is over for you. Yeah, tomorrow as uh, I guess Amber said, it's a new month, new expectations, new goals. Knew everything. 
Let me just check something. I'm in doubt <laughs> with something. Expectation, expect, <laughs> that word, <laughs> me too. <laughs> yeah, but no, no, we say expectations, that's okay. Mm -hmm. And finally today I could achieve my my 150 goal. That's so you made the, the, the bonus. At the end of the, the, the afternoon, yes, I did it. I completed. It. Yes, thanks God. Okay, I did it. Okay, that's cool. That's right. Yes. Yes, because yeah, this yeah. is that bonus. It's, it it's a pain. Exactly. It hurts, it's a pain. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, no, I mean, whenever we get bonus, we are like, oh, cool. Yeah, yeah, because just achieving the 150% is additional $150, so it goes. Yeah, you know, well, you know, I know someone who told me like two days ago, hey, I got my, my, I got my bonus and I'm like, oh, cool. What about you? And I'm telling no, I'm getting my bonus until I just get it twice a year. I get it around June, July. And, and it's okay. I mean, it's a couple of, of hundreds and it's nice. Ah. And you know what? This person's got a bonus of 4,000. Wow. That's uh, a bonus. Yeah. Maybe it's because of the type of job this person has yeah but i mean in salary it's almost the same but the oh, bonus bonuses yeah, yeah i mean we are and why is so that high different i don't know i don't know but bonus is beautiful i mean with what bonus like that i would be like oh yeah oh i mean you uh, are you referring to the bonus you're getting as a uh, all the teachers in June, I no, guess. Yeah, but for me, it's just uh, like, I don't know. I don't remember, a hundred and something, I guess. Oh, yes, but it's a, that, that one that is like, uh, yes, it's a bonus you receive in June, right? It's because yeah. you work in education, all the, the people working yeah. in education, I guess. Uh, and the other one is the Christmas bonus we all get, right? Yep, exactly. Ah, okay, okay. No, but that's awesome because you have 14 salaries, let's name it in that way. No, I don't. Mm, yes, because the 12, uh, one per month, and then if you summarize the Christmas bonus and the other one, it's a kind of like having 14 salaries or no, it's too cheap, the, the bonus. Oh, okay. A hundred and something. Oh, okay. No, it's, so it's not considered salary, as a salary. Mm -hmm. No, it's not even. It's not even a, a quarter of a salary. Mm, okay. Okay. No, if I if I had a if I had a bonus like top the salary, man, I would be like cool. Uh, yes, yeah, that know. is why I'm asking because if your friend or the person you are talking about. Uh, he or she is getting a bonus uh, on that I amount of mm -hmm. yeah, maybe no, it's, that's a beautiful a beautiful bonus uh, it depends uh, what would you do with four thousand dollars right now well more than what you do with 150 <laughs> in your case <laughs> at least but you are a workaholic teacher at least you may Think oh, on no, of course, of course. That's, I mean, traveling. No, I mean, yeah, not really. I mean, I don't have. You, you see, time you to see, go you don't like uh, traditional Salvadorian food. You don't enjoy other things. Uh, you don't like to go out and. No, working, that's what I like. Come on, teacher. Yeah, what? It's fun. <laughs> yeah, but you, you need to rest sometimes. You're. Nah, Brain. I'm gonna I'm gonna rest when they throw some dust, some dirt on me. You know? Rest in peace, I know. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna have enough time for resting. No, but it's cool. I mean I like I like working. The thing is 
for real, uh, to be honest. Uh -huh. I don't like long vacations. I like vacations, but short yes. vacations. One week vacation is perfect for me. Ah, okay. But I guess uh, more than, like the one we had at the beginning of the year, that it was like more than a month, I guess. Yes, more yeah, than. Yeah, that's horrible. That's terrible. Mm -hmm. Don't even well... remind me that. <laughs> okay. Welcome to the class. Nice having you. Thank you, teacher. Let's see. Um, sorry, guys. I told my thing. Let's see. Let's see. Who else is around? Well, I've been talking just mostly to girls. Just said with Fredo. Frank. Hello, Frank. How are you? Hello, teacher. Fine. How are you? I'm just fine, just fine. You know my question for you all the time, every single day. How's the weather? <laughs> Very cool, teacher. It's, it's better than yesterday. Really? It's cooler than yesterday. Really? My gosh. Yeah. That's cool. So how, how many degrees today? Uh, let me see. I'm gonna check right now. It's about. It's it's the same degrees as like yesterday, but the thermic sensation. I don't know if it's correct. Okay. It feels. It feels cooler. Yeah, because I mean, here supposedly we are at 23, but man, I feel it hotter. That would be perhaps on the street because inside the house it's different. Let's see. I think I lost Frank. Well, Mr. Rivas, Jose Rivas, hello, good evening. Hello, teacher. How are you? How's everything? Uh, so I can sense that so far so, so far so good. So today was a terrible day. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. A terrible day. Yeah, because I have never uh, taken so a lot of cold. Oh, really? How many did it take? Around 70 cold. 70 cold? Yes. Oh my gosh, that's a lot. Yeah. And how so, many do you usually get on a regular day? On a regular day, so with a vela, I think that is around 25, 28. Okay. So, My gosh, so you got like a double. Yeah, more than double. More than double. Man, that's crazy. Yeah, I feel stressful. Believe it or not, uh, uh, I was I about, guess as soon, I was I about guess as to soon, go to my bed. <laughs> oh, 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 that's bad. That's bad. But the good thing is that you're here. I imagine yeah. that as soon as the class finishes, you're going to crash. Yeah. Yeah, immediately because uh, basically uh, my schedule was changed by yesterday. Oh, really? Yep. So because as usual, I work from one to eleven, but today I started around ten a.m. and finish uh -huh. to at uh -huh. eight. So after work, so I enter to the meeting. Okay, and did you have dinner already? Uh, yes, just a judge. Juice. Yes. Juice. 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 No. Juice. 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 Ah, sorry. Juice. Yeah, like that. Because Juice and Josh is Josh. Yes. Judge. Mm -hmm. So in yeah. this case, it's Juice. Juice. Okay, yeah, just oh. a Juice. 
Everybody's on that diet here. Come on, guys. <laughs> well, Not the I ate pizza. Okay, Jose Gutierrez says, no, he had pizza. That's cool, man. That's cool. I love pizza. Yes, true. We yeah, have to just, jump the rules. Yeah, of course. But just juice, Jose Rivas, man, that's... Yes. That's sad for me. I mean, I'm, I need something a little bit heavier. So the thing is that uh, actually I take my lunch, sorry, my, uh, yeah, my lunch around 12, uh, 12 in half. So, but today, okay. so I, I took, a bit, uh, I have my lunch around 2 p.m. Mm. So it's, yeah, for, because, was no a normal day, so I had to change basically my breaks and lunch. So in order that, yeah, yeah, because you were you having know, right? a big load of job of work. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't want to disappoint you, Jose, but maybe this schedule, the the it hasn't available like the one you already have, or yeah. do you think the day? <laughs> It was just a day. Yeah, after, so believe me or not, after so the class, so I just take three calls in one hour. So it's oh. basically really nice abela. <laughs> but today, no. So yeah, maybe it's the schedule but, you are right now. Yeah, not really. It's for the season. And also, it, it's they say that it's the low season, but they don't, they, basically they don't have enough uh, people working. Oh. That is the reason. Oh, okay. Okay, mm -hmm. hope tomorrow get better. So we'll be uh, better. Probably. Or, so you can help me out to <laughs> move on to your account. <laughs> that would be nice, that would be nice. Okay, yeah. Jose, thank you, welcome. Thank you. Stephanie, hello, Stephanie, how are you? Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm doing, doing better? Yes, better than yesterday. Yes, because uh, yesterday I feel uh, pain on my body and my throat was bad. No, bad. What's wrong that today? Okay, what's worse? Uh, well, okay, what's worse than today? And now I can talk a little bit and I have some cough, but not like yesterday. Because in my in my job right now, there is kind of a epidemic for flu. So there is a mm. lot of agents with flu. And I was like um, a little bit worried because I thought that maybe I couldn't go today to the, to the job. But when I woke up, I feel better, so I decided to go to the job because uh, there was another supervisor that that is uh, with COVID and he can't go to the job, so we, I have to go. So for that, I decided to go to my job and hopefully I feel better during the day and I just take some pills like para like palagrip and I said, and paracetamol. <laughs> and but I feel good better than yesterday. Thanks for asking. Okay, well, thank to you for making the effort and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see, who else? I still got uh, two minutes. Um, hey, Lena, how are you? Hi, teacher, good evening. Good evening. Very what fine. time did you get home last night? Tell me, tell me, I wanna know. 1 a.m. So yeah, I told you. I told you. My, 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 sister, one, uh, my sister is here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> No, yeah, I don't you, wanna, you see, I'm just going to say hi like this. <laughs> okay. You see, I told you, I told you. I mean, it was going to take you like 20 minutes to get there. Then you will have to wait for her to get to the car, then going back. 
Yeah, I told you. It was going to be like around 1 a.m. Man, late. Yeah, and, and the, the, the area uh, when uh, the area was uh, very, very, I don't know how to say it, como llena, full, full of packed. people. Yeah, and, packed. And yeah, cars, cars and traffic. Yeah. Uh, horrible. I just yeah. came home and took my pillow. Yeah, you just crashed down. Yeah. Yeah, well, you and know, it was different back in back in the days when I was young. I used to go to a concert. I used to stay there after the concert and sleep, whatever. Or just with the friends talking until early in the morning. We were like, eh, who cares? Let everybody go. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. I mean, it was different. It was a pretty different situation. Yeah. But because of that, today I felt very tired. Oh, really? Well, as long as you don't crash in the class, I don't want to see you like <laughs> go down on us. No, no, no. But the rest of the day was very, very, very good. A lot of paperwork oh. again. Mm -hmm. And well, after work, I had a, a bridal shower. Uh, what? Yeah. Oh, I know what's that. Poor lady. Yeah, one of my best That's... friends is getting married. So oh, I'm her... so sorry for her. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah. So her mother-in-law uh, organized her this like little party with friends, family, and the groom was there too. So oh, that was that was boring. That was boring. But it was they delicious. <laughs> they should have asked me, man, we used to throw some parties with my friends for those situations. But it, but it was delicious, the dinner. Oh, really? Actually, it was delicious. What was there for dinner? Tell me. Uh, it was like a um, pincho. Yeah. With a different type of meat. Okay, and a meat stick. Meat stick, thank you. And a slice of kind of potato cake or something like that with a very delicious sauce. And oh, from the dessert, it was a, no sé cómo se llamaba en real el postre. It was like a mousse of chocolate with okay. dark chocolate with a cherry. Uh -huh. But it was delicious. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. That means that you have dinner already. As soon as the class finish, you're gonna go to sleep. Yeah. Well, I have to do my my skincare because all women here. How long does it take you? No, the, the the skin suffer if you don't take off your yeah, of makeup course. and and all the stuff that that we used to in the whole day. Okay, and how long does it take you? Around 20 minutes. 20, 20 minutes. Yeah, 20 minutes. Yeah, uh, it takes me like one minute, you know. I just get some <laughs> soap, wash my face. That's it. No, no, well, I wash my face with soap, then I put a lotion, then two, two different types of creams. I have to wait a few minutes because uh, I don't know how to say it. No se queda pegado en la almohada. Already? Oh, yeah, for the skin to, to absorb it. Yeah. And after, after all, I go to sleep. That's crazy. Yeah, <laughs> I don't have that type of problem. As I tell you, I just wash it and it's ready. <laughs> Sometimes I when I, when I, Tired, yeah, just me. wash my, my face. Only that I don't do that skincare routine. But today I have to. Okay, well, good luck. <laughs> Welcome, Eliana. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, guys, let's see. Well, uh, we are going to start working. I got a topic for you. A very interesting topic. 
Uh, we always watch TV, listen to music, read books. I mean, and there's always, uh, we look up to famous people according to our taste. I mean, some of them are famous for us, like their music, like their art, their what they do, how they behave. But now I want you to look inside yourself. Because the question that we are going to be asking and answering to your classmates is this. What would you like to be famous for? I mean, would you like to be perhaps a, a singer? Or perhaps would you like to be famous by writing a book or perhaps in, in medicine? What would you like to be famous for? I mean, there's always something that we feel attracted to or perhaps something I wish you, we wish we were better at. So that's what you are going to be discussing. It's a little bit interesting and I know you're gonna have fun discussing this. Remember, we are in reported species field, so you're going to be reporting to me about your classmates, okay? So if it's possible, take notes, 10 minutes for this activity. It's gonna be long. I need you to take notes because when you report to me, I need at least two sentences per person that you're going to tell me. And I'm talking about full sentences. Like, she told me that, he told me that, okay? Please guys, jump in, let's work. Okay, let's see. Let me go check them groups. I Activity don't... is uh, one question. Yeah. We have to, to discuss and then... I'm, I'm sorry, guys. Sense? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, I just need to, to, to move someone from this group. I'm so sorry, Francisco, I made a mistake sending you to this group. You were supposed to go to another one. I'm gonna send you right now. Okay. Bye, Francisco. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys, my bad. And don't worry, teacher. So what would you like to be famous for? I start. Well, I when I was a, a, a child, uh, I dream with be a singer. I dreamt. I dreamt. Thank you. I dreamt to be a singer. Okay. What type of music? A rock singer? No, mm -hmm. more maybe Opera. more like pop, pop, romantic pop. music, pop. Okay. Romantic music, something like that. Oh. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Yeah. And what happened? That never happens. <laughs> Your voice, no. <laughs> Some people said, and and my family told me sometimes that tell me sometimes that that I have a good voice. Okay, really. we we are gonna hear it once at least. That once family, we need to hear it. but they they love me so. <laughs> So no, you but, need to you need to record yourself and and get connected and send it to us. It's mandatory. What? No, I just think about it. when I take in my shower or something like that. My neighbors in the morning, my neighbor, my neighbors is like six thirty a.m. and 
She's singing already. Oh my God. <laughs> In the karaoke. Yeah. yeah. You should do that. I mean, the thing is this, uh, actually, according to the germ that you like to sing, uh, the style and some voices are good for perhaps some type of music and some other voices are good for other type of music. Yeah. Uh, what about karaoke? Do you enjoy it? I love karaoke. Okay, yeah. do you usually go? Uh, uh, before the pandemic, yeah. I used to go a lot. Where did you used to go? Uh, karaoke 4020. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, well, actually, uh, I won a, a, a contest. A contest of um, national music. That was the mm -hmm. rule. Uh, if, if I want to participate, I have to sing. Uh, okay. One song which, of, uh, someone which, that, that. Which song did you sing? In that moment, that was like uh, maybe five years ago, I chose uh, this song. Um, ahora, ahora serás tú. Uh, in that moment, uh, this this girl. No, girl, this woman, uh, Hafet Jerez, she participated in the contest, uh, the, uh, the numero, el numero uno. Mm. But uh, she, she made this song and it was on the, on, the, on the list and it was the only because the rest of the, the song uh, was in a male voice. Mm. So, but some some male songs sound beautiful when a girl sings them. Yeah, but uh, with national music, it's kind of 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 weird, uh, or I don't know how to say it. Maybe difficult to choose a song that no sé cómo esa palabra se acople, acoplar, fits. that fits with my type of, of, of tone. Okay, which is your pitch? What are you, uh, where do you move on? Is it a contralto? Ah, How soprano. high can you get? Oh, you're a soprano. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I was in my church car, cars. Yeah. Hmm. Do you want to hear something funny? When back in the days when I haven't uh, treated so badly my job, my my pitch was a girl's pitch. Mine was contralto. What? In contralto, yeah, and contralto is is a range for for ladies. Yeah. But that was the the ones that I could move on between those keys. Well. Yeah, yeah it was it was funny. Interesting, actually. It was funny. But, you know, after so many vices, the pass of yeah. time, and I, stopped, and I stopped practicing, and now my, my voice is darker. My voice is yeah. pretty dark, and because, I mean, there was a time, like, when I was like 20, that it was fun if I was calling, my, if I was making a phone call, they used to tell me, yes, miss, because my pitch was, I mean, the, the voice was not that dark. It was very clear at that time. And I used to take care of it, I mean, because I was also playing instruments and I was playing instruments like wind instruments. But nowadays, man, if I see the animals die. <laughs> well, in my case, I... Oh, I'm sorry, I need to go check a group. They're calling me. Sorry, 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 my bad. No, no, it's okay. Jose Wilfredo. Oh, who's the new guy? Oh, no, it's Stephanie. No. <laughs> I was wondering, who's, 
Yeah, because I mean, it, the voice is pretty low, lower than mine. I was like, who's this? No, I hate when I have uh, throw. No, when I have, yes, when I have my throw like this. Yeah. Because I, I, speak I was like gonna, the... I was gonna ask Jose Wilfredo if he had changed his picture, but then I realized, no, oh, it's still funny. <laughs> No, <laughs> sorry. There, and yesterday was worse. I couldn't oh, hear you. No. So no, what but I was talking? gonna ask you. I was gonna ask you if you had changed the picture on your on your profile, but then I realized that it's a Stephanie who's speaking very dark. <laughs> yes. <the people laughs> <say that. laughs> yeah. No. And Jose Wilfredo's voice is pretty dark, very low. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's gonna my, my don't worry. My voice is gonna is gonna change in a few days. <laughs> you know something funny? I mean, I have all, always I get problems with my voice when the change of weather and stuff with with my truck. But my voice, just once in my life, once I lost it. But oh. usually, I mean, it doesn't change at all. No, the ma no, the my voice yes every every time change or I have go or I can speak. Uh, there was one time that I that I can speak kind of for three days. I couldn't speak for three for three days, and the doctor said you can still speaking, and I have to. To oh, have the incapacity, I don't know how can I say the permission to. <laughs> no, it, that's a leave of illness. How, how sorry? Leave? It's a leave of illness or leave of absence. Okay, leave of accent is <laughs> easy. Leave of accent because I was sick for that. So, so, bad, so bad. for me, it's kind of common. I okay. don't know why. <laughs> Let me check another group, guys. Am I you. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> yes, Jose Wilfredo? No, in my case, it uh, was really funny because when I was a child, I saw like cartoon. And then, and then when I, when I, uh, when I was like 10 years, my voice started to change the strong. Yeah, well, I was telling your classmate that uh, something like that happened to me. Well, actually, I was 20, 21, and my voice was pretty mm -hmm. light, was not dark. Mm -hmm. But, uh, <laughs> um, and it was funny because I used to, I used to sing, and, and when I was singing, my voice was pretty clear. But... In my case, what affected mm -hmm. me was the way in which I treat my throat and my voice. I mean, I didn't take care of uh -huh. it. I was drinking tons of coffee. Mm -hmm. At that time, I was smoking like two packs a day and staying late at night. And I mean, oh, yeah. not covering, uh, drinking water, cold water almost all the time. So I messed it up. I end up with this, you hear now. But that's life, no? Hello, hello, hello. 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 Hello, Maria Alejandra. Tell me, what's your dream? What, what? Would you like to be famous for? <laughs> if I have the opportunity to be famous, I make a cartoon voices. Oh, really? You? I would like to. <laughs> no, but I don't have an idea in this moment, and it's a good idea. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, that's fine. That's fine. What about you, Amar? Well, teacher, I actually, I don't, I wouldn't like to be a famous person, but uh, if I don't have any option, maybe I would like to be a rock star. 
Okay. Well, you know, <laughs> you don't you wouldn't like to be famous, but if you have to, you will pick a rock star. Come on, Amber. You know, that's the complete opposite of what you said at the beginning. From not being famous to be a rock star is like complete opposite. <laughs> What's my unique idea? <laughs> my only, my only idea. Okay, my no, only. that's that's okay. That's okay. What about you, Marcos? Okay, teacher. Uh, if I could be famous for something, I would like to be famous for being a professional football player, or football, or soccer player in Europe. In Barcelona specifically. <laughs> okay. <laughs> nice. What about you, Mr. Rivas? So if I have the opportunity, I, I would like to be a musician. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, a musician. musician. And what? Like a singer, a player? A player, a player musician. Okay, what would musician. you like to play? Uh, back in the time, <laughs> I was I was telling uh, they, them so that basically I would like to be like a singer and a player, piano piano player. Oh. Yeah, but nowadays, so my mind is different, right? So with the instruments that I learned before, so like a con conquista player. Okay, Hong. Hmm, that's nice. Yeah. And also, I got the opportunity to, to play. So in in a like in a live concert, so with an orchestra. I was oh, for that's cool. yeah for one season around three years ago. That's great, awesome, yeah. awesome. That's nice. Hey guys, let's go back to the main room. It's time. Okay. Okay, wow, it, it's been a very interesting activity, actually. I have heard very interesting information about you guys. Let's see, well, but before we move on, I need to get the, the attendance a second time. Please, Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present, teacher. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. Ana Claudia Gonzalez Velasquez. Present teacher. Ambarelli Alfaro Gomez. I guess. Uh, Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejia. Present teacher. Heidi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Present teacher. Henry Neftalit Mendez Torres. Here I am, teacher. Ileana Giselle Cañas Escobar. Present. Jacqueline Ciomara Morales de Castro. Present. Jose Marcos Rodríguez Ayala. Present. Jose Osmín Rivas Navas. Present. Jose Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present, teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present, teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Rebeca Jasmine Monterrosa Figueroa. Roxana Iveda Asensio de Mejía. Present. Stephanie Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. Billman Frank Figueroa Peñate. Present. Ramón Enrique Mata Escobar. Present, teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Okay, guys, let's see. Well, let's listen to you. 
let me check on the groups. Okay, who's gonna start? Uh, uh, uh. Marcos, tell me about your classmates, please. Okay, teacher. For example, for me, he will be famous for being a musician and play to play in piano. To play piano, sorry. Uh, uh, Maria Alejandra. Yeah. Told me she would like to be famous. Or uh, do cartoon voices? So, okay. Do cartoon voices or or in the chef? And and um, I don't remember the last one. And but, what about yourself? Um. Oh, okay. Well, um. I guess I would like to be famous for not food. Okay, thank you. Now, Jacqueline, what about you? Um, well, um, let me see, teacher. I take some notes here. My class friend was. I, my classmate told me that um, he would like to be famous to get a lot of money and buy a new house and all the things that she needs. And Heidi said that, told me that he would like, she, sorry, he would like to be famous to help uh, kids with um oh, i forgot the details without this yeah thank you heidi for that reason oops okay thank you very much excellent now let's see um hmm. Frank, tell me about your classmates, please. Okay, teacher. Well, Ana Claudia told us that she would like to be famous for traveling around the world, uh, getting to know different cultures, and all of this without having to work. Oh. Uh, Henry, yeah, very good. <laughs> Henry told us that he would like to be famous for being a great Hollywood actor. And Francisco would like to be famous for having his own grilled meat restaurant. Oh, nice. Yeah, very nice. That's cool, that's cool. Whenever you mention food, I mean. <laughs> great, cool. great, excellent. Now let's see. Uh, 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 um. Stephanie, tell me about your classmates, Stephanie. Okay, let me see. Uh, in my case, I was talking with Jose, Wilfredo, and, and Ramon. Uh, for example, Jose Wilfredo would like to be the same as me, and he would like to be a singer. And, and also uh, Ramon. He said that he would like to be a famous that had to be something kind of like for science or technology. But also in the other hand, he would like to be a rock star, kind of Rata Blanca and Mago <laughs> Okay. Cool. And yes, in my case, and singer too, or playing in a band, something like that. Okay, nice. Excellent. Okay, Eliana, tell me about your classmates. Okay, my classmate was Nicholas and Ada. Okay. Nicholas told us that he would like to be a, a kind of important leader of a 
in institution of an international institution that protects the environment. In order of that, uh, he would like to make a change in the society and in, and in the world in a big, big scale. And Ada told us that she would like to be a, a famous doctor or something like that uh, to help others in a big scale. And in order of that, of that uh, she would like to make the world a better place for all the people who have big health needs. Okay. That's quite interesting. I know Pam would fit you. <laughs> no, you would like to. <laughs> okay. I am no. Okay, okay. Well, that's great. That's great. Okay, guys. Let's see. Next activity. Well, we're going to keep on talking about famous people. You know, whenever you, whenever somebody is famous, I mean, they live a very exciting life, but also, I mean, sometimes, sometimes the situation gets bad for them. I mean, and, and they are in, on the spot all the time. Uh, there are good things, bad things about being famous. And that's what we are going to talk about. The first question we are going to be talking about is what are the downsides of being famous? The bad things, what is the downside? Okay. But also, uh, you're going to tell me the benefits. Okay. So you're going to be asking and answering or talking among yourself in this case, what are the downsides of being famous and what are the benefits of being famous? According to your opinion, according to what you see, I mean, the ideas you got uh, related to the topic. You're going to be working with uh, somebody different for this activity. So I switch the groups, I change the members of the group, and please jump in. In this case, you just need six minutes for the activity. Let's jump in, please. Hello. Hello. <laughs> this what Stephanie, a... you should better <laughs> take it easy, Stephanie. Your choice is getting bad, so don't worry. <laughs> if you want, you can just listen to your classmates, okay? I understand. It, okay. It's a fair Perfect. Thank you. <laughs> I feel the same tissue. <laughs> and Maria Alejandra is gonna say, "Yeah, I'm exactly the same." Yeah, sure, sure. I know you, my dear. I know you. Okay, that's why Maria Alejandra, you are going to start. Um, teacher. Um, I'll be back. Okay, okay, okay. Do it, please. Okay, and um, the first one side, I think, and um, the famous person doesn't have the, the famous person don't have uh, privacy when they go outside with their family or visit any place. It's a don't like for being famous for me, I think. And they can, they can have a, um, what can I say, uh, privacy life? Privacy. Privacy life. Privacy. Thank you, teacher. A privacy life. Yes. Um, one of the benefits I 
thing that are um, pe famous people, well, the brands or many companies uh, hire like um, models or to promote it. Promote. Sponsor. Sponsors, thank you. The sponsors. Yeah, the, companies, the companies sponsor the artist or the famous ah. person. Ah, sponsor the answer, yeah, the, uh -huh, the famous one. Sponsor. The famous one to promote the, their product. Mm -hmm. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Yeah, and they have, um, they get a lot of money and maybe, do you hear me now, Ada? Hello. Yes, we hear you. Well, at least I hear you. I yes, what you. happened is that the sound was breaking down, teacher, and she was talking, and there was like a, a sound breaking down. Perhaps the connection is giving problems. Yes. I don't Shall know if Fredo is able to. And so the brother is like, he says, like, no, no, I'm not, I'm gonna. Well, but you can do your sentences, Anakali. Ah, okay. Get them unwritten, get them unwritten, okay? Okay, okay. Uh, the actions, for example, Will Smith in the Oscars, right? At the, at the Oscars. At the Oscars. But that was very, very, very weird, right? Yes. <laughs> Some people said that it was planned. Planned, yeah. But I think so. Stage. Stage. Stage? Yeah. Okay. You say, you what is the meaning? Sorry. They always are in the wow. Huracan okay. eye. <laughs> yeah, yeah, of course. Stage. What is the meaning of stage? Sorry, teacher. Es significado. Es significado. Okay, got it. And their benefits always their money. <laughs> We, we were talk, we were discussing teacher that and we are agree that uh, maybe one of the big downsides is that most of the celebrities or fam famous people lost their privacy. Yeah, sure. We agree. No, we are agree. We uh, agree. That's a verb. We agree. Okay, thank you. We agree in that that the privacy does is lost. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, yeah it's you lose privacy. privacy. Yeah, well, yes. actually, a few, a few of them are able to keep their private life private, but it's hard. It's pretty hard for them because there's always somebody like looking for their info. And you know, yeah, but you know, the problem is this. The problem is that. Uh, People don't respect private life. And people want to yeah. know about their private life. And I mean, I can admire, in my case, I can admire and respect an artist, and, but uh, I, don't, I don't understand how they can try to get to know everything about their lives. For me, it's like weird. But that happens even if, if you are not famous, right? I mean, people wants to know always. Yeah, people is nosy. Like, yeah, yeah, right, right. It's people is nosy hard to and, say, people like, and people like to gossip. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I mean, as my grandma used to say, no alimenta pero entretiene. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes don't 
if people doesn't have enough things to do so that's the reason that they <laughs> that they are so nosing as you said right nosy nosy what is nosy, nosy like like news yeah mm -hmm. instead of news why at the end nosy Metiche. yeah exactly that Metido. that's nosy <laughs> Yeah, that's no I mean, people is like that and that's i don't know i don't know if it's if it's part of human nature but most of the people always want to know and you know it's i don't know it's just that the the culture is like that that something juicy is something when when uh when some info is juicy is because it's something bad is happening to somebody else, people get attracted, right? Or yeah. yeah, yeah. But as you said, maybe it's part of the human nature. I don't know. Yeah. It's sad. sadly, but maybe it's like this. Maybe true. Yeah, maybe true. Yeah, well, complex, you know. Humans are very complex. Yeah. Yeah. We are pretty complex creatures. Mostly women, you know, Frank. Yeah, of course. They <laughs> get like, what? What? No, it's, ju it's just like the song. Like, I comprenderlas. Oh. So, no. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, but you, do you remember the rest of the song, Ileana? Sí, las a cosas más bellas veces, de esta creación son las flores. A y... veces, a veces. <laughs> sometimes they are good. Sometimes. A veces sometimes. solamente palabras. Dulces. Mm, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And sometimes just bad words. <laughs> y no reproches. Yeah, exactly, exactly, exactly. We know the song, Ileana, we know the song. <laughs> yeah, we know the other part of the song. Yeah, we know the other <laughs> side of the coin in this case. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah, as I told you, we human beings are weird and complex, pretty complex, yeah. but I mean, that's part of life. And yeah. being famous is not, it's not easy, I guess. No. It's not easy. Yeah. I mean, for, I don't know if I could stand that, the, the, the not being able to, to my privacy, to have my privacy. I think yeah. that would be the most taxing uh, aspect of that situation for me. Yeah. But as I don't have that problem, <laughs> and I don't think I will have it, never. <laughs> Let's go back that's to not, the that's not, our, yeah. that's not our yeah. case. Yeah, it's, it's we not are average written people. on my book. Yeah, we are cool. With, with normal life. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Good things, bad things. Let's hear it. Let's see. Heidi, you home? Heidi, yes, no. Okay, who's gonna help me? Uh, Francisco. Hello, Francisco. I want to talk to me now. Uh, Marcos. Hi, teacher. 
Oh, finally, somebody <laughs> wants to talk to me. Tell me, Marcos, what do you think are some of the apps uh, or the apps and laws of being famous? Okay. Mm, one downside, I think, could be when you are famous, uh, you don't have so much privacy when you go outside with your family or visit any place. Uh, another thing, another downside, I think it could be um, um, your health is in dangerous because a lot of singers traveling around the world spend a lot of time in, in the stage and traveling and they don't have enough time to rest or eat something health or just do exercise and it could be dangerous for and the, the pace of life is very hectic for them you mean yeah yeah i think and okay. uh, ben benefits ben benefits yeah benefits um one could be uh, the enterprise or companies or i don't know um pay you for using your image okay perfect excellent thank you very much Martha. okay let's see anna claudia what do you think uh, one disadvantage is that you become like a public person and everybody knows what a um uh, you do and what you don't and everybody wants to know about your life I, I think that is a disadvantage because you don't have privacy and maybe the advantage it will be that if being famous uh, that makes you to make money uh, that's okay <laughs> if you increase your incomes that's okay you're making good bucks. That's fine, you said. Uh huh. Yes. Okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Thank you, guys. Now, 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 now. I got another one. But we are really, we are still talking about famous people. If you could have, I don't know, dinner or lunch or a drink with any any living person who's famous, of course. Who would you choose? Who would you pick? It doesn't matter if it's alive or dead, okay? I want you to tell your classmates who would you pick and why, okay? Not just who. I need you to explain to your classmate why. You will have just five minutes for this activity, okay? I need you to take notes because you are going to report about who your partner wanted to, to meet, okay? So, uh, in this case, you are going to be working with the same persons you were in the previous exercise. So jump in, please. Hello. 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 Okay, guys, there's four of you. Okay. So you can talk, you can practice.
they um, are poster from poster the people inside in the pop man leader. Poster Maybe the people. It, it, oh yeah. What was the name? Yeah, of yeah, this? like nice song. They, they. I mean, there was the. the, the oh, what was the name? Is Pump Up Kids. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they, they were very yeah. famous for that song. Yeah, yeah. In the United States and in the schools. <laughs> yeah, it became very famous at schools. You better run, better run faster than my bullet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I I would like to have a dinner with the with the leader of the band. Oh. Ooh. Yeah, I like the the mm, music style they perform. A uh, dinner with, with, with me? Uh, oh, not with me. Oh. No, <laughs> with a famous Thank person. You. I choose. Oh, uh, I'm not famous yeah. enough. Famous person. <laughs> Roxana is. Who yes. did you say, Roxana? I chose Robin Williams. Robin Williams. Robin Williams. Hmm. Robin Williams. Yeah, because I love uh, they his, they their movies. Yeah. His, his and, movies uh, and his yeah. comedy. His movies. Yeah. Sorry. His movies and whatever that uh, he represent. It was cool. So I would like to talk to him. To be honest with you, not my type of comedy. Why? I don't know. I like it. I like dark comedy. No. Well, yeah, in your case, yeah, you love dark. Everything dark. Yeah, sure. No. For Roxanne, it's very important to dinner with the teacher of English, Pupusas. Oh. <laughs> uh, uh, you are so nice at kicking me out of your room. See ya. Also, he has, she, she has a lot of talent. Who, yeah. Who, who? Yes. It's a singer. I don't know. Lady Gaga. <laughs> Who is it? We Who is it? Oh, uh, we were talking about who I choose. And I told Frank and Amber that I choose Adele because okay. I, I love Frank, her type. Um, Frank, Amber, and Fernando, who's also here? Fernando? Okay. Good evening, hello. Ah, uh, hello, Fernando. And just yeah, in him. Yeah, he made okay. it, he made it. Yeah. <laughs> Adele, Adele, yeah, nice music. Yeah, no, and, and I was telling to, to Frank that I, I like his type, her type of, of career is very clean. She keeps the her life in, uh, Private, right? That word, teacher. Yeah. What? Private, 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 and and that's the reason why it, okay. I I love. Yeah, let's see. Me, I would choose. Well, it depends because if it's a musician, uh, I got two. Actually, both of them are from Spain. Uh, one, Diana Navarro. And Joaquin Sabina. Ah, uh, Joaquin Sabina. Mm -hmm. It's a classic one. Yeah. Those yeah. two, I mean, I love their music. Very good choice. Yeah. And what about you, Ambar? Well, maybe Johnny Depp, because he's my favorite actor. Yeah. It's a, a, pretty, multi a pretty interesting character. Yes, uh, I think he, 
he's a uh, multifacetic. Yeah, poly, poly, polyphasetic. Polyphasetic, yes. And yes. I would like to meet him, meet him, and only that. Yeah, let's see, actors. Ooh. Mm. The only one that I would love to, but it's because, because back in the days, I mean, it was my uh, Gwyneth Paltrow. Oh, yeah. Oh. She's so beautiful. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. <laughs> I, mean, I, re I remember, I remember the first movie that I watched of her uh, at the movies. And what was it? Grandes Esperanzas. I never heard about it. Beautiful movie. Beautiful movie. And it was interesting. I was young at the time, man. Okay. Very young. What about you, Fernando? We are talking about uh, if you could have dinner or a drink with somebody famous, uh, who would you choose? Um, somebody famous for, for lunch or, yeah, or yeah, like somebody, that. yeah, so you can talk and spend like some time talking with that person. Okay, oh, I will choose my favorite singer. Okay, who's Jose Madero? Mm. Banda, yes, ex singer of ex Panda singer. singer. Okay, today is Sol Solis. Solis. Okay. Solis. 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 Yeah, today is Solis. 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 Okay. Today is Solis, but his career in, in this stage is, for me, is better than, than the previous career in the group. Before yeah. her, um, before oh, him there, are very. Oh, you know, now that you mentioned uh, that, uh, that germ. There's another singer that I would love to meet, but I don't know how. Well, yeah, now now it's easy for her to speak Spanish. Daria Turunen, man. So, okay. so lovely. Sorry, Frank. What kind of, of music she plays? Oh, she used to be the leading voice of Nightwish. Doom. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, Nightwish. Yeah. Okay. I mean, oh my gosh, her voice is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Yeah. Well, let's go back. Let's go back. Okay. Well, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh -huh. Frank, I never came to ask you, who would you, who would you choose, you said? Or I don't remember. No, uh, you didn't. I'm so sorry, I apologize. <laughs> I got no, excited. No. No, don't worry. I will choose maybe some writer. Uh, Gabo? Well, yeah, Gabo. Yeah, of course. I think that having a, a coffee with, with him could be oh, perfect. Interesting. Brady. It must be an entertaining talk, an interest, interest, interesting talk. In, yeah, of course. Could be perfect to talk yeah. with, with Gabo. Yeah. 
Yeah, I wouldn't make up my mind because for me it would be too complex between El Gabo and Milan Kundera. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't mean like oh I, I don't read it nothing you. about about it. I recommend him to you. Okay, okay, if okay. you like El Gabo, perhaps you could like me like okay. okay. Thank you. Let's see. Heidi, hello Heidi, welcome back. Hello, teacher. Tell me, Heidi, if you could have, I don't know, a drink or a dinner or lunch with somebody famous, who would you pick? I would choose Michael Jackson or, or or Cristiano Ronaldo. You know, you came, you went just to completely different <laughs> areas. Okay, why why would you choose any one of them? Uh, you know, uh, in, in in the past, my my dream, my golden dream, was uh, to go to a Michael Jackson's concert. Then he decided to die. Yeah, bad choice. So my dream was over, but I love him. I love his Ooh. music. I love his talent. Do you want to hate me? There's just like two songs that I like of him. Which At one? all. Ah. <laughs> one uh, black or white. And the other one, the, the earth song, I guess. Is the name of it? Which one? Yeah, the Air Song. Yes. The Air Song. Mm -hmm. Arsenal. Which the song? Earth, the Air ah, Song. Arsenal. Okay. And, and and black or white. Mm -hmm. The only two ones I I do like of him. I, I don't like know why. Arsenal. And about Cristiano Ronaldo, I like the way he thinks. He is always positive. In his mind, in his mind, he's always the best, and that thought makes him achieve many goals in his career. Quite interesting. Hey, he's a handsome guy. I like him. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> okay, Just that's because. another reason. Thank you, Heidi. <laughs> okay, Nicolas, who would you pick? Okay, teacher. What is my opinion? Yeah, who would you pick? I can ask her if you could have dinner or lunch with somebody famous. Well, I think for me, a uh, uh, one person very famous for me is my father. Uh, he, I, I, I think is. Mm, I, I, I think uh, for the dinner. Uh, well, well, my father. Dad, uh, three years ago, and I need, I need a moment with with he, uh, with 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 him, with, with him, uh, because in in the topics more more uh, serious, for example, I think it's very important uh, dinner with Vladimir Putin, for example, today, and to know uh, your opinion about. The, the situations, the, the situation in, in Ukraine and the situation, the, your position with or from the great, great countries, for example, United States, uh, United Kingdom, France, and other, 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 other countries, other governments. Uh, okay. Perfect. Thank you. Interesting. Okay, thank you. Jose Wilfredo, what about you? I'm sorry, teacher, but my internet is unestablished, so I couldn't hear the, the, the question. Okay, if you have the chance or the opportunity to have a drink or a lunch or dinner with someone famous, who would you pick? With Zidane Zidane. That's a good player of soccer. Soccer player. Yeah. That's okay. A good why? Why? Why would you like to? Oh, because I I like how he played and all award that he received when he was a, a player. Okay. 
Interesting. Yeah. Thank you. Ana Claudia, okay. what about you? Well, I would like to have dinner because I like to laugh a lot with maybe I would like to know Eugenio Derbez. <laughs> I okay. think that I will enjoy. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. So you think that person is going to be, I mean, you could have a good time talking to yes, him. Yes, laughing, laughing. But I also like, uh, I don't know nothing about football, but I like the, the lifestyle of Cristiano Ronaldo. And I admire that he has, he's, I think he's young and has, a lot of kids for me, I think. I know he has the money to do whatever he wants, but what Heidi said is true. The way he thinks is interesting, very interesting. Okay, thank mm -hmm. you. Okay, you're welcome. Now, let's see. Uh, um... Ramon, what about you? How do you think? Who would you pick? Hello, teacher. Um, I would like to be at uh, dinner with Jennifer Lawrence. Jennifer Lawrence, okay, why? Because I think she's a very funny girl when she talk, talk uh, in, a, in a show, I don't know. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Hello. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, I, I hear you. I hear you. Interesting. Thank you very much. And let's see. Sorry, sorry. I have a, a problem with my internet. Okay, no problem. Let's see. What about you, Mr. Rivas? Okay. Hello. So, yep, I'm here. So, I have two options. And the first one probably will be like <laughs> having a dinner with Scarlett Johansson. <laughs> okay. I wonder why, you know, I really wonder why. Uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> nah, yeah, she's really, uh, she's gorgeous, basically. Yeah, gorgeous. Yep. She's gorgeous, of course. Yep. So, and also that the second option that I, I really agree with, uh, I don't know who who provide that information that see that in see that. So okay. I was I was reading uh, some comments about him. So that actually uh, his vision so uh, start with like uh, with uh, his father advises so to be a like a play soccer and also a soccer uh, player. Soccer, soccer sorry soccer player. And also he got the talent at the very beginning, right? And then so he continues so his career. And also now, and nowadays, so he's a like, how to say entrenador, like trainer? Trainer, yeah. Or coach. Like he's a trainer. So like basically- no, coach. She, In this case, a coach. coach. Okay, and she achieved a lot of goals. So on her life. Okay, perfect. Eliana, what about you? I would like to to have dinner with my favorite singer, that is Adele. Okay, why? Tell me why. Because I think that, when, well, I love her career. I, I think that her career is very clean. She, I love that she, how she, can keep her life in private and I like that and I think she's a, 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 a no not a role model but maybe a good example that yeah, in this that, world that means in, you were not a big fan of Amy Winehouse <laughs> no no because well you know yeah, yeah, sure, sure. That 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 stuff about drugs, it's a very yeah, it's heavy, it's heavy stuff. Yeah, and and well, they are famous people. So a lot of, of people and young people are watching them. 
So yes, sir. that's yeah, one of the reasons that I that I I I would like to 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 talk and 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 have a a, a dinner. It's a deal okay. because of that. Perfect. Thank you. Now let's see, Ada. What about you? Mm, I have a dinner teacher, and the famous is a. Uh, Sherman Moore is an okay. actor the the serious criminal men. Criminal uh, men uh, solve the important case. Also, the a doctor participate in the serious and the support. And okay. is a handsome man. man. Okay, okay, that's nice. I that's think nice. that's the, the truly reason. <laughs> yeah, that's the, that's the main reason. That's the main reason. Yeah, well, you know, I used to tell my, 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 my wife that those were training programs. And you, and you teacher? Me? Well, uh, in my cases, my interests are also very, it's so complex, like, if it were an actor, uh, I was saying um, Winnet Paltrow. Uh, if it were a singer, Joaquin Sabina and Diana Navarro are two that I would love to, to talk to. I mean, to have a, a very interesting conversation. Okay, guys, you got, well, you got a couple of followers. One of them is that uh, thank you very much for the activity. Uh, today was going to be just uh, speaking practice. Uh, tomorrow we are going to work on the manual. Uh, but I wanted to remind you of something. For tomorrow, we are supposed to have finished section one, section two, and mill term. Okay? Remember, that's for tomorrow, section one, section two, and mill term. Please, if you are behind, Try to do it along the day because I'm gonna be updating my list on um, tomorrow after the class. I'm gonna be updating it, and they check it out on Saturday morning. So the ones who have not finished those two sections for Saturday morning, I will be texting you to remind you on the weekend because I mean, I'm sorry guys, but they push me. I gotta push you. Okay. You know, that's the way it goes. If you have finished, thank you. I appreciate it. You helped me a lot because I mean, I try to update the list every single day, but I need to make the, the announcement to everyone. Let's see what else. Oh, you have something a little bit extra. This is gonna be simple, simple, okay? Uh, for tomorrow, I need you to think about food because we're gonna be talking about food, but we are not gonna be just talking about, oh, which food do you like? Which is your fi favorite? And we are not gonna be focused on that, okay? Tomorrow we are gonna be talking about like, what's your perfect breakfast? How healthy is your diet? And what are your guilty pleasures when it comes to food? But it's that one that you know that is not good for you, but still you take it once in a while, once in a blue moon. All of us got little something that we know that is not good for us, but we crave it, right? And something else. Oh, how has your tasting food changed over time? That happens. I mean, some of us, don't like some stuff that we used to eat when we were younger. And we are gonna be discussing and talking about that. So uh, I will set apart sometimes so we can have that conversation. It's going to be interesting. I'm letting you know, so you can start like uh, thinking about it because when it comes to food, the for us is one of the most difficult topics and I'll let you know why. Because we don't usually hear I mean, uh, if you go to regular classes, you don't usually get to talk about food. Uh, food and procedures. 
is not a topic that you find in manuals, not regularly. And asking for food, talking about food, that's a, that's a topic, an everyday topic in the States. I mean, whatever, whatever you go, your friends, uh, you go to a job, they invite you, hey, let's go have lunch. Where? What do you like for lunch? How do you like it? And I mean, everybody talks about food. That's normal. So that's part of the vocabulary that we need to start thinking about. So for tomorrow, I need you to start thinking a little bit about that along the day because uh, it will be easier if you got some ideas like ready in your mind. Uh, okay, guys, let me see. Time's over, believe it or not. So let me get the final attendance. Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Ambar Elia Alfaro Gómez. Present. Ana Claudia González Velázquez. Present teacher. Francisco Eduardo Figueroa Mejía. Present teacher. Jairi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Henry Neftalí Méndez Torres. Here I am teacher. Thank you. Ileana Giselle Cañas Escobar. Present. Jacqueline Xiomara Morales de Castro. Present. Jose Martos Rodríguez Ayala. Present. Jose Osmín Rivas Navas. Present. Jose Wilfredo Ayala Sorto. Present, teacher. María Alejandra Barrientos Romero. Present, teacher. Nicolás Atilio Méndez Granados. Present. Rebeca Yasmin Monterrosa Figueroa. Roxana Ibeta Asensio de Mejía. Present. Tienen mucha. Alejandra Salmerón Ibarra. Present. Es que no Susana Beatriz Ortiz de Cornejo. <coughs> Belmen Frank Figueroa Peñate. Present. Eh, Jairi Eugenia Salguero Arribas. Present teacher. Thank you. Ramón Enrique Mata Escobar. Present teacher. Fernando Marvin González Martínez. Present teacher. Thank you very much, guys. Eh, always a pleasure to have you here. Nice class. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Take care. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Thank you for your time. Sleep cool. Sleep tight. Sleep tight. <laughs> okay. Bye. Some of you are crashing, right? Ah, uh, teacher. Yes. Yeah, tell me. Uh, I already finished uh, the section two and the midterm, but uh, with this thing that the platform had a, has a the, that problem with the with the, some answers that uh, you remember. Yeah. The exercise with the match okay. the, ter the, the terms with the uh, with the meanings yep is it still wrong the platform yeah they haven't fixed it up yet uh, let's see so Lara, what's your name again oh yeah. mm -hmm. well, you got 98 come on man. that's the only one that is giving you problems right yeah <laughs> It's in section two, and you want the hundred percent. Okay. I'll let you know uh, as soon as they fix it. I let you know so you can fix it up. Okay, that's not okay. a problem. Remember that in the platform. I mean, uh, the platform takes into an account your highest grade. Okay. So you can do the exercise more than once, and not a problem. They're going to okay. to take into an account your highest one. Okay. Okay. Thank you. You too. <laughs> Bye. Well, no, I gotta stay here until 10 more minutes. Okay. Because okay. I have somebody here assigned and didn't come. Bye. Have a good okay. Night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Yeah, I was supposed to have somebody here, but that person didn't appear. So.
Meanwhile, we're going to check a little stuff here. And we're going to close this.